All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to find the whole, and uh, we're going to focus on this problem. It says these are 30% of the apples in the barrel. How many apples are in the entire barrel? So obviously, we have these six apples equals 30%, and we're trying to find the entire barrel, which means we're trying to find how many apples is equal to 100%. There's a bazillion different ways to solve this problem. One of the ways to solve it is, you know, kind of like using logic and to say, well, if six apples is equal to 30%, and we're, the goal is to figure out how many apples are equal in, in one, 100%. So if this whole thing is 30%, that means we could see that two apples equals 10%. Two apples equals 10%. Two apples equals 10%. And since our goal is to get 100%, well, if 10% is equal to two apples, then you times this by 10, you get 100%. You times this by 10, you get 20, 20 apples. Okay, so that's one way, kind of using logic. Another way to do it is uh, we can make a table. And we could say, all right, let's do apples and percents. If we wanted to, we could switch it and, and we could have put the percents on the left. But we've got six apples and that equals 30 percent. So a lot of, and then we're, we're trying to figure out how many apples are in 100 percent. A lot of different ways to figure this out. I see one way. I could see that six times five is equal to 30. So something times 5 is equal to 100, and that's pretty easy. Just use division, 100 divided by 5, and we could see that the answer is 20 apples. Um, another way, using this very same table to figure it out, is we could use division and divide this by 3, which gives us 10%. Divide this by 3, which would give us 2 apples, and then it's kind of like this problem over here. 10 times 10 is 100, so 2 times 10 is 20. Um, a third way, pretty common way, is kind of more of the official textbook version where you think about the proportion percent over 100 is equal to part over whole. And that's, a, that's the official, you know, classic proportion. And in this problem, we know the percent. It's 30. And we know the part. It's six apples. That's the part. What we don't know is the number of apples in the whole barrel. So I'm going to put that as our x. And now it's time to figure out the value of x. Um, I would just see a horizontal relationship that 6 times 5 is equal to 30. But the official textbooks would probably tell you to do this cross products technique, in which case 30 times x is equal to 600. And then using division, x is equal to 20 apples. Lots of ways to solve this problem. Here are three of them.